Hey track builders, my name is Dylan, and today's challenge is to build a Halloween track. Let me show you how I hacked the track. Haunted houses are so cool, so I built this track for when my friends come trick-or-treating at my house. Each track goes to a trick or a treat. Want to see how I built this? Ready, set, build! I want to build a track that is packed with cool tricks, so I'll need to start with this because it has four different starting lanes. Okay, I need to make a right turn here. These should do the trick. Here's everything I used to build this track. This will be a pulley system. The cars in this cup should be heavy enough to make this ghost fly. The car will hit the monster truck here, which will hit the cup off the table, and boom! Here comes the ghost. All right, let's give it a try. Two, one, go! Oh, the car didn't go fast enough to knock over the cup. That cup is really heavy. If I'm gonna knock it off the table, I'm gonna need more power. This loop should give the car an extra kick. I bet this will do the trick. All right, here we go. Yes, that was perfect. Now, let's work on the next track. The next track is gonna be another trick. So let's do something eye-popping. Watch this. This track will make a U-turn right back to the launcher with a tricky surprise at the end. Eyeballs. This booster will give the car a lot of speed. The car will burst through these ping pong eyeballs and they'll fly everywhere. All right, let's give this a try. Here we go. That looked even cooler than I expected. Wow! Let's see that again. Okay, let's move on to the next track. Hey, skeleton, you look hungry. Let's build a track that drops down to feed you some tasty cars. Oh, let's build a track around the graveyard. Maybe this guy can hold up the track. Chew on this! This is exactly what I need to send this track straight to our friend. I'm gonna need something here to keep the track off the ground. Perfect! I can turn the stool upside down and it'll be the perfect height. Then I can add this folder for some extra support across the bars. Now I need to keep holding the track up to reach the skeleton's mouth. Oh, I know! I'll use this toolbox to hold up a stack of cups. Six cups will give me just the right height. Who's hungry? Three, two, one, go! Oh, so close! The car almost made it to the end, but it didn't have enough speed to make it up that hill. Let's add another launcher to make this work. That should do the trick. Here we go! Wow, that was really cool. Look at that speed! <laughs> okay, now that I have three awesome tricks, it's time to build a track for treats. Let's build a track all the way up to the doorbell. This is a pretty far distance so I'll need a lot of speed to go up these stairs. Okay, the best way to the doorbell from the rail is to go straight across. I need a lot of things to support my track. I added a stool, a box of bugs, a book, and a bunch of other things I had laying around. Yeah, this is gonna work. Okay, I think these curves will guide the car right into the doorbell. Phew, this is my biggest track yet. So hold your breath. I sure hope this works. Oh, so close! This slope is really steep. 
The higher the track goes, the more speed I need going up. I hope this extra booster gives the car more speed. Here we go! Trick or treat! Woohoo! That was so cool! Go, go, go! Yes! And it made it across the bridge, too! All four trick or treat lanes work. Now it's time to play a little Halloween game. Choose a car if you dare. <laughs> Each car has a number on the bottom. Choose a car and send it down that lane for a trick or a treat. Track one, go! me every time. Track two, go! That was awesome! They're looking right at me. Track three, go! I bet he was so scared. <laughs> Track four, go! Treat. That was such a fun challenge. Thanks for checking out my Halloween track. How will you hack the track?